Sea Biscuit is a story about a thoroughbred racehorse in the early 20th century. A small horse, Sea Biscuit was considered a symbol of hope for many Americans during the Great Depression. Sea Biscuit has been a subject of many films and novels, but the movie I'm going to be focusing on is the most recent film, Sea Biscuit, that was produced in 2003. This movie, being very historically accurate, was nominated for the Academy Award of Best Picture. Being as prestigious as it was, it still had its flaws in the film. To start, one part in the movie that was different than real life was the way Red, the jockey, injuries were shown. The movie shows Red getting hurt virtually on the eve of the match race, but the injury occurred months before. In the movie, he makes his comeback just in time to ride in the Santa Anita Handicap, while in reality, he had ridden Seabiscuit in tight prep races. The depiction of the Santa Anita Handicap bears not even a faint resemblance to the way the race was run. While the Santa Anita Handicap was being raced, the film shows George, one of Seabiscuit's rivals, allowing Seabiscuit to pull forward after the jockeys had a brief chat. Obviously, with the loud cheering and such short time of racing, this chat did not happen. Another part in the movie that lacks resemblance to real life would be how Red's life and disabilities are portrayed. In the movie, Red tells Howard and Smith, his owner and trainer, that he lost because he didn't see Rosemont, the winner, coming up on him. He confesses that he's blind in his right eye. Although this is true, his excuse for losing that race in real life was that he had been stuck on the rail, which was slow, and was unable to get to the outside. Had he let on that he was blind in one eye, his career would have been over. Not my fault. Not this time. I told you, look out for Rosemont. I thought I had it. You stopped writing. I couldn't see him. What the hell are you talking about? He was flying up your tail. No, I can't. What? See out there. He lied to us. What? He lied to us. You want a jockey who lies to what? us? What do you mean? He can't see. He's blind in one eye. Another part of Red's life that is altered in the movie would be his background. In the movie, Red's parents suddenly leave him, telling him it's time for him to make his own way. They did in fact leave him, but not on his own. Red was given a personal advisor that was a family friend who stuck with him for a good portion of his career. This is not shown in the movie. The movie also makes it clear that Red's family goes broke due to the depression. In reality, Red's family was well off. His father was a factory owner and a real estate developer and didn't suffer as much as others during the depression. Although this movie is very historically accurate, there are still some flaws in the film. Thank you for watching.